In today's Idea Express, we dive into the world of Magic Words, a book by Jonah Berger that explores the profound impact of language on our thoughts, decisions, and relationships. This thought-provoking exploration reveals how the slightest changes in our words can have a ripple effect, influencing our personal and professional lives in ways we might not even be aware of. Magic Words offers practical insights on how to wield the power of language for our benefit. It's about understanding that the words we choose are not just a medium of communication, but a catalyst for change, a way to negotiate better, motivate effectively, and build stronger relationships. The magic lies in the subtleties of language, in the nuanced changes that can trigger profound shifts in perception. Ready to discover the magic of words? Let's unravel three key concepts from this book and how you can apply them in your daily life. In the first concept, behavioral influence, we find the language we use can steer our actions, shaping our personal and professional success. When negotiating in a professional setting, instead of asking to lower the price, invite a discussion about the factors behind the pricing. This approach encourages a conversation rather than a simple no. When motivating team members, motivate them to identify with the success of the team. Instead of saying, let's work on this project, say, let's be a team that excels in project completion. This subtle shift in language instills a sense of agency and ownership. When it comes to personal goals like eating healthier, reinforce your sense of self-discipline. Rather than saying, I can't eat junk food, say, I don't eat junk food. This affirmation strengthens your personal identity and makes it easier to resist unhealthy temptations. Remember, the power of your words can influence behavior. Use them wisely to achieve your goals. Moving on to the second concept, linguistic psychology, the connection between language and our thoughts, emotions, and identity is stronger than you think. Let's consider how we can put this into practice. When enhancing relationships, using emotional language can deepen connections. Instead of being neutral, say, I feel concerned about this issue. This fosters empathy and understanding. In the realm of teaching, moving beyond presenting facts to engaging students emotionally can be transformative. Try saying, let's embark on a fascinating journey of discovery to inspire a love for learning, and in conflict resolution, avoid accusations. Foster self-reflection by asking, can you help me understand your perspective? This encourages open communication and empathetic resolution. So next time you engage in a conversation, remember, your words carry emotional weight and can make a significant difference. Finally, let's delve into the third concept, subtle language shifts. Small changes in our language can have big impacts on our self-perception, decision-making, and problem-solving. Consider your self-talk. Rather than thinking, I should do this, shift to, what could I do to tackle this challenge? This encourages a solution-oriented mindset, transforming a challenge into an opportunity. In the realm of team building, replace, we should be more efficient with, let's aim to become a team known for efficiency. This subtle shift fosters a sense of identity and purpose, motivating every team member towards a common goal. For personal growth, instead of saying, I need to improve my skills, try, I could enhance my skills through consistent effort. This moves you from a state of obligation to one of potential, sparking the drive for continuous learning and improvement. As Jonah Berger beautifully illustrates in Magic Words, the language we use can shape our reality. So, choose your words carefully, for they possess the magic to transform your life. Before we wrap up, let's quickly recap the magic we've discovered today. We've unearthed behavioral influence and practical ways to use it in negotiations, when motivating teams, and in developing personal goals. We discussed linguistic psychology and its use in enhancing relationships, improving teaching, and conflict resolution. Finally, we covered subtle language shifts, illustrating how minor word changes too can enhance self-perception, decision-making, and problem-solving in various life aspects. Until next time, remember, your words have power, use them wisely. Ever wish the wisdom of your favorite books could seamlessly translate into your daily life? Jump on board the Idea Express. Each review comes with three tailor-made, actionable steps drawn right from the book's core insights, steps you can instantly infuse into your personal and professional life. Subscribe to Idea Express today and become an Express learner tomorrow.